Salutations to my fam, yours truly Simon A. And yeah, I know. Halloween's been over for three days, and I'm posting this in November. But if the Simpsons can do it, so can we. Anyways, we have one last spooky Halloween treat for you before I hang up my tombstones and cobwebs and set up the turkey, birthday cake, and mistletoe. And that is a brand new spooky Halloween short from the new cartoon spin-off of Baby Lemon Friends, Capital Academy. My friend Randy and everyone else involved did such a great job putting this together, and we hope that you enjoy it as well. So, here's the premiere of the new Baby Lemon Friends Capital Academy Halloween short. Enjoy! Ah, ah, ah. I hear you've been expecting me. Yes, we have. What took you so long? What? The Grinch? I thought you were more focused on taking over Christmas. Do not remind me! Besides, Halloween is the night for Grinch Night! It's a wonderful night for eyebrows. It's a wonderful night for teeth. It's... Yeah, yeah, $60.60. Save your theatrics for someone who cares, okay? Beetlejuice? Not really. My name is Jerry, and this is just a cosplay. Not really villainous or anything, just a plus one for Trumpy here. My original idea was to build a wall and have all the trick-or-treaters pay for it, but they wouldn't go for it. That's not even remotely scary, Trumpy. Sit down, you haven't been called. Besides, walls cause claustrophobia. And whose kid is this? I ain't no kid, loser! I'm numero uno! And we're gonna take over Halloween because we got the gates of hell on our side. Gates of hell? Yeah. Ain't that right, fatso? I'm not fat! Anyway, Mr. Darkslayer, was it? I normally associate myself with an assassination business, but my client shared his most humble opinion for this plan to be executed perfectly in order for humans to be so scared that they begin the process to commit die. He needs subtitles. And who's the client? Why, hello, Halloween lovers! My clever genius has this idea so that we can seize control of Halloween in all capital city! And all cowardly upcoming sinners would be at our command. And yet you took your sweet time coming here. Okay, I screwed up, so sue me. Hey, Myers, don't forget to pour the dragon blood! Myers? As in Michael Myers? Well, not really. It's actually Mike Myers. But he prefers to be called Wayne Campbell for some reason. Wayne's World! Wayne's World! Woo! We're gonna have an excellent summoning! Summoning? What is he talking about? We're going to be summoning the spirit of Halloween. The Halloween spirit himself? Ooh! You're going to love him! He's such a hoot! Exists. What the? I, 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 I can't believe it. <laughs> After so many centuries, it feels so exuberant being summoned to Earth. After a long while, I see we've got some experienced villains interested in taking over Halloween. Well, I'm just a cosplayer, so... SHUT UP! This year, we're gonna find a very, very special way to celebrate Halloween. It's not like the Dark Ages. Everyone was frightened, miserable, plagued with disease and sorrow. Fun times for me with such power. Calm down, Derek. Calm down. Vampires aren't real. Ghosts aren't real. Goblins aren't real, Frankensteins aren't real. Just the thought of fear puts me in a jovial mood. Ah! Pokey Bell! Seriously? Napping on a job? It's Halloween night. We're at the time where pranksters and egg and TP people's houses and put razor blades and candy are running amok, and you're sitting around like a scary cat. 
Get out there and get to work, or you can clean out your locker tonight, buster. Sorry, chief. Fear practically Christianizes Hallow's Eve. It's named after me for Pete's sake. But modern society has commercialized it to be about stupid cartoon specials, juvenile pranks involving toilet waste, and getting free cellulite and cavities from sugary snacks. But now that I've been summoned, we can spread misery, villainy, and fear all across this cursed, unforsaken land. Oh, ancient Halloween spirit, how will we be able to do that? Simple. We're going to start a jinx that will corrupt and manifest the souls of all victims to a more obedient and scary state and bring fear all over Capital City by night's end. And no one, not even a single sentient being, will be able to stop the fear from spreading. Follow along if you know the words. Monsters of the night, beasts from below, rise and get our errant foes. Make them scream, make them sweat, and that's a Halloween they'll never forget. Halloween and Capital City will be mine, and everyone will know the name of the spirit of Halloween. <laughs> <clears throat> so. Who wants cupcakes? Booga! <laughs> you just 